Rhinos, Day 2. Please take out your science packet and open up to the second day, Rhinos. Today we'll be working on Rhinos habitat. Remember, a habitat is where a animal lives. Today we'll be learning all about where rhinos live. For this lesson, you'll just need your pencil out and your packet. Later, you'll need your crayons to draw a picture. Let's begin at the top. I'm going to read aloud to you. As I read, you'll have some blanks to fill in along the way. Then we'll reread the paragraph all together to make sure we learned all that we can about rhinos and where they live. The word rhino, did you add an O onto the end of rhino? The word rhino means nose horn. Why do you think they're called rhinos? Well, they have a big old horn on their nose, and that's what their name means. Rhino means nose horn. There are five, you could write a five on this handwriting line. There are five different kinds of rhinos that live in Asia, a capital A for Asia, and another capital A for Africa. There are five different kinds of rhinos that live in Asia and Africa. They often live, eh, eh, you can add an I for eh, live. They often live alone, especially when they're older. But a mother, you write T H for th and mother, T H, mother. But a mother with her babies live in a group. If you add a P on the end of group to make it into group. So they often live alone, especially when they're older, but a mother live, lives with her babies in a group called a crash. What a cool name for a group of rhinos, crash. That's what a group of them is called, C-R-A-S-H. What an interesting name for a group of rhinos. I imagine maybe someone saw how they crash into one another and maybe that's why they're called a crash. Pretty cool. Let's reread this paragraph together and make sure we learned all that we possibly can about rhinos and where they live. Put your finger up on the first word, the. I'd like you to track with your finger while I read aloud to you. You can rest your pencil down. The word rhino means nose horn. There are five different kinds of rhinos that live in Asia and Africa. They often live alone, especially when they're older, but a mother with her babies live in a group called a crash. All right, what was your favorite fact about rhinos and where they live? My favorite fact was that a group of rhinos is called a crash. So for my picture, I might draw a mother with her babies, and I might write the word crash above to show that a group of rhinos is called a crash. Maybe you like that rhinos live alone when they get old, so maybe you'll draw one old wrinkly rhino all by themselves. Whatever you choose, make sure you add lots of detail and color. Then when you're done, Make sure to watch the two videos that follow so you can learn more about a rhino and its habitat. 